Welcome everyone on a perfect night for football with the floodlights beaming down. My name is Derek Ray and sitting next to me here on the commentary gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham United midfield man Stuart Robson and getting ready for a potentially thrilling contest. It's Greece and they take on Spain. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. And here's the starting 11 for Greece. Well, on paper, they look a very balanced team. But the three advanced midfielders must at times make runs beyond the centre forward. Otherwise, they might just lack a bit of penetration. Here's the lineup for Spain. As Piliqueta starts with Marcos Alonso in the fullback positions, Coque starts with Sergio Busquets in central midfield, and they line up with just the one striker looking to do a bit of damage. And the match is underway. Sarabia not sloppy in possession Anastasios Bacasetas well they stopped them in their tracks given away by Busquets Okay. Oya Sabal couldn't make it 1 0. Maybe not quite warmed up. Well, that should have been the opener. He has to hit the target from there. Well, they couldn't keep it. And attempting the through ball. Just unable to take advantage of that developing situation. Koke. And Torres on the ball. Koke now gets involved in the attacking side of things. And a goal kick it'll be. Too much height on the shot. Sergio Busquets 
The ball with Rodri. Well, what can they do to stop him running at them? But nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. He's very adept at protecting the ball. Possession changes hands. The interception there. Mavropanos. It's with Savelas. Intercepting it intelligently. Bodies forward and the break looks on. He continues his run. Can they get in behind them? Corner coming up. And Koke with the delivery. And the danger cleared. And a body in the way. This is looking threatening. Sarabia. Firing it in. Will he finish? What a lovely strike. Lethal piece of finishing. Drilled home with true conviction. Tremendous goal. Well, as you can see, he gets everything right here. What a skillful volley that is. One nil then. Well, you've got to keep the ball a bit better than that. Getting forward. Real chance. Well, really fine goalkeeping. Good diving stop. Well, can they draw level here? The crowd certainly thinks so. Nearly at the break then, and the visitors have eked out a lead. Stuart, an opportune moment, I think, to get your assessment. Well, they've worked hard and played well to be in front here, but they now need to keep their focus as we approach half-time. Koke. And on the ball, Sarabia. Possession one. Now, do they mean business on this occasion? It might be. Can they stop it going in? Well, he stumped it out of there without much fuss. And the referee has awarded the free kick. He tried to play advantage, but it wasn't forthcoming. Yorios Yakumakis. On the ball, Georgios Masuras. Showing patience as well as persistence in the build-up. Oh, but they've lost it now. Well, the stats don't lie. Spain haven't dictated the play so far. But when they have had it, they've looked so dangerous, particularly when they press high up the field, win the ball back in those areas, and then counter-attack quickly. Really getting stuck in. And breaking at pace with Menes. Can they create something? And a goal! Cause for 
celebrations again. Two in front. Well, here's the replay, and just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. Well, the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. Well, Koke has been doing his bit to run the game, Stuart. Well, what a display from him. Lots of touches, some great passes and an assist. He's been absolutely brilliant today. Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Okay. Rodri couldn't grab hold of it. Might really be able to trouble them here. Well, he missed the targets and then some. Wide it went. Has the strength to hang on to it. Moving forward effectively. But ultimately up a cul-de-sac. Well, the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Really good high press. Splendid tackle and a throw-in coming up. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. Rodri and Torres on the ball. And possession given away. Giorgios Tzavelas. It's with Siopis. Good technique displayed. And they could get one back here. My goodness, that save. Fully stretched he was. One for his own highlights reel. Well, could this be the turning point? The fans are certainly hoping so. Now sending it in. Well, no end product. I don't think he'll be proud of that challenge. And it's left to the referee to decide what happens next. Well, he has been dismissed. And it was going so well. Well, that's going to make it interesting now. He's just put his team under pressure here. Long way out. Well, the free kick taken, but saved easily by the keeper. Effective looking pass. What can they do from here? 
Manolis Siopis. Well, not hard to read that pass. This looks threatening. But mistimed his run. Well, he's got the timing all wrong there. He just needs to bide his time. So making the substitution now. And now they have the ball back. Opportunity it is. And not cleared away properly. Oh, marvellous goalkeeping. Well, it's a top-class save from a top-class goalkeeper. That's absolutely brilliant. Well, the stats tell you everything. At times, they've controlled possession. They've created some good opportunities going forward. There have been some good attack in play. But when they've had the chances, they've been really poor in front of goal. It's just not been good enough. Promising attack launched by Sergio Busquets. And it's gone behind for the corner. Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. Now the delivery, not the best clearance. Well, they can bring it out now. Dimitrios Pelkas. Going well. And a no-nonsense clearance. Buchalakis. Excellent challenge. Oh, he's left his marker for dead. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. They've got it now. What can they do? And the ball is loose. And the keeper put to the test, but he comes through it. Well, he's so sharp, isn't he? Great first save and then the recovery. Could reduce the deficit. Oh dear, that moment might come back to haunt them. A bad miss. You sense that had to go in if they're to turn this around. They simply haven't been at the races today. Pablo Sarabia. Good tackle. Manolis Siopis. Oh, that pass easy on the eye. And turned onto the woodwork. An incisive pass. Still possibilities. It'll be a corner. What about the opportunity from earlier? Let's have another look now, shall we? The corner played into the box.
And so the final whistle here. The visitors come out on top, Stuart. Well, Derek, they were dominant in most aspects of the game, particularly in that midfield area, and they also looked threatening in the top third of the pitch. It's a really good result for them. Well, an awful lot to like, Stuart, about what Rodri has produced in this game. Well, he should be pleased with himself today because he performed really well, he scored a good goal, and they won the game. An excellent day all round.